is the Alpha Cool Ice Ball. And this particular product is a pump reservoir combo designed for the D5, their uh, 755 and the 655 pumps that they have. Uh, this uh, <laughs> neat design has a in and out port uh, on the back side of it here. Um, has a addressable LED ring that goes all the way around the inside. Uh, the, the top has a fill port uh, to allow you to fill the coolant into it very easily. Uh, and it also has a Alpha Cool uh, inscribed logo inside there where the uh, fluid actually flows out. Um, this particular model that I have in my hand does not come with the pump, as you see, uh, but it does come with the O-ring. Um, so uh, all you would have to do is you would either purchase or use your previous uh, existing D5 pump. Um, and it's f fairly straightforward. Uh, all you would do is drop the O-ring in, put the pump in, and put this ring screwed down around it. And as you can see, the, the O-ring is there. It just kind of drops in there. There's a little channel that sits around. The pump would go inside there. This would secure the backside of the pump, and then you tighten it down just like that. And give it a nice couple good turns, and that'll be nice and tight and ensure that it's not going to leak. Uh, but again, this uh, particular product is now available, um, and it is a pretty neat design for any of your water cooling setups. Uh, again, it is addressable RGB all the way around, and it does come with uh, uh, Alpha Cool's new controller, the uh, digital controller here. Um, it also does come with every, uh, all of the items that you see over here, the mounting hardware, the, the manual, um, but it also comes with a different mount bracket that you then you've seen before probably uh, this one is designed to fit on 120 millimeter and 140 millimeter fan brackets um, and the bottom uh, as you can see is threaded uh, for the screws and the mounting um, but it, it's the exact same style of mounting as the eye station uh, so the same plate can be used and uh, the same bracket can be used um, but they also include if you don't want to use you know the bracket or um, if you want to just use the plate you can use the plate and some velcro uh, they give you a nice big sheet of it so you can cut it in half uh, and and size it up onto this pad appropriately uh, they also give you the nice little alpha cool t-handle uh, to to open and close the top there, uh, which by the way, this port is recessed. Uh, the stop plug, although it is a plexi stop plug, the plug is uh, one of the new Alpha Cool recessed plugs. Uh, so it is relatively flat on the top. So all of the items that you see here are included in the kit. Um, you can order it either with the pump or without the pump. And again, it does work with uh, D5 pumps. Uh, whether it be the 655 or the 755, doesn't matter. It does work with both. Um, this ring is removable. Um, the, the procedure is to just kind of hold both thumbs on top and just pull up and the ring will pop right off. It does have a channel in the back here to tell you where it actually needs to go, um, like on, on the reservoir when you're reinstalling it. Um, however, this reservoir does not, it does not twist apart. So don't try and do that because you will in, in, end up breaking the seal. Um, and this is actually uh, welded together. So it's not removable. It's not supposed to be removable. So don't do it. Other than that, uh, this thing is fairly straightforward. Again, you got an in and out on the back here. Um, your LED ring goes down and sits around the fitting, just like so. Um, you have your cable that comes to the end. Uh, now you can daisy chain these together uh, with the different, if you had two of them, or if you have a couple different Alpha Cool ARGB products, uh, you can daisy chain them together with their fancy new connector that they have. Uh, so what we're going to do is just show you an example of how you can mount this uh, reservoir with its LED system and a pump in it uh, to a 140 millimeter platform. Uh, so what I have here is I have one of the new uh, Alpha Cool V2 radiators, uh, the 280 version. And what we're going to do is mount the Alpha Cool eyes ball to the top of this radiator. Uh, so all you have to do in order to, to do that is, well, First, read the instructions. Uh, it is in a wide range of languages and tells you how to do it um, and tells you how to do it properly. Uh, but it also, if you are looking to uh, make holes or design your own sort of bracket, it gives you the different sizes and the different spacing uh, for, for the mounts. Uh, so that is also another option and great information for you that is included in the manual.
cool eyes ball. If you want more information or would like to order one of these products, you can find it on Alphacool's website or through one of their many distributors. And this would be a great addition to any water cooling custom loop setup.